Hey, 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 guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am back with another episode of Ultimate Fishing Simulator. And we are out here on the ocean on our luxury cruise boat. We're fishing for various species, such as marlin, amberjack, uh, mahi mahi, which is what I caught most time last time. But this time I got a couple of lures that might help the situation out based on some of the input I've gotten from my uh, viewers. And we're going to give it a try here, guys. But first of all, let's get to where we need to go. Let me turn the sound down a little bit. It is a little bit loud. There we go. I hope that's better. It's not too quiet. But the motorboat is kind of loud. Well, we're going to try to find a good spot. Lots of activity. And it looks like right over here is not too bad. Let's go ahead and get out here. But this lure I've got on here looks a lot like a squid. And I think that's the point. They love the squid. Or the cuttlefish or whatever. But we're going to take a good look out here and see if there's anything swimming around. Looks like there's a few of them. There's a Mahi Mai. I can tell that off the bat. But let's just give it a shot. We'll see what it does. Not sure the technique that needs to be used for this, unfortunately. But we're going to try a few things. I think they said somebody said it was also need to be real fast. So let me let me give that a shot here. Now if I can remember how to make it feel faster, let's see, is it No? Ah. Fast as you can. Fast as fast as you can. Yeah, guys, I did a little research on the luring methods, and apparently they're not as straightforward as in some of the other games. But you got to use the stop and go, you have to let it drop a certain depth. Otherwise, it won't work, and 10 meters is pretty much where it has to go to. Right now, I'm not sure how far down it's gone. But we're going to go ahead and give it a shot here. Let's see. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Well, it's not doing anything. Let's uh, drop a little further. Oh, it's rising. So it's light. Interesting. So maybe the straight method is the best method. Well, nothing seems to be going for this. Despite my best efforts. Well, maybe not. Let's try this again. 
I got the lift and drop down. Let's try a lift and drop since there's one of those guys. Lift and drop, you have to do this and pump at the same time. It usually works. See, there you go. I think I'll try to take the speed down a little bit. Maybe that's the problem. Alright guys, I have tried a few of the lures and I'm not having a whole lot of luck. So I think I'm going to try just doing some float fishing. And I did try it last time and I found out that I need a really much larger hook than I had had before. So I've got a couple pieces of cut bait on here and we're going to see if anything goes for this. I have no idea if this line is going to be able to hold something as big as a marlin, but we'll see if anything goes for it. Now, Greater Amberjack, I'm sure, will probably do just fine, but let's take the tension down so that we don't cause ourselves some problems. Well, I'll be damned. Check it out. Oh, no, he just passing through. <laughs> That's pretty cool, though. Yeah, he didn't seem all that interested. No, there's plenty of activity. I'll be damned. There's a, there's one right there. We got him. Or he's got us, I'm not sure which. I'm not sure about this. He's just hauling off with it. So what I'm afraid of is he's going to spool us. Just slowly keep adding tension up. He isn't even close to tired yet. And if I don't start turning him around soon, it isn't going to happen, people. Yep. He ran out of line. He is just too strong. Hmm. Yeah, we'll try it again. If not, we'll see if there's anything stronger, but I think I might have a leveling issue here, guys. It may be that I'm, my level's just not high enough to get the stronger line. I couldn't even slow him down. There's another one. Come on. Well, at least I'm getting into the fight. Take the camera up here. Maybe we can do something off. Nope, he ran out of line again. Dang on it. He's just too strong. 
Let's see here. What could we possibly do line-wise here? I have got 49.61 pound line. And that's hardly even touching him. Let's see. So that's this one. That's fly line. Okay, this is 88. I don't have enough cash for that. <laughs> yeah, what I need is at least this. And I have to be level 20 to get it. Well, I'm not so sure this is going to happen. Not unless we get a smaller one. Let's see what we got out there. Now there's some other species out there too, so maybe... I don't know guys Just managed to get him turned around before he gets out to 400 feet. I'm slowing him down. Nope. All right. Well, we have proven one thing. They are just too strong for what I gear that I have at this point. Oh, that sucks. Well, let's go ahead and downsize our hook here a little bit. If there is another method, I don't know what it could possibly be, but I just do not have a str strong enough line, and that's a pretty strong line. <coughs> so let's take the hook down a couple of notches. Yeah, let's go ahead with an 8. Let's put a nine on there. And let's see if there's something else that'll go for it. Probably mahi mahi, but just a little disappointed that it didn't turn out as well as I'd hoped. There we go. That looks like a greater amberjack. Now that we can handle. That we can handle. And he's actually starting to slow down a little bit. Come on, big guy. Jeez. 
Jeez, how big is this fella? Shoot. I swear to God, I am not having much luck with catching these fish. They're just so damn strong. I think what we're going to do is try to go down hook size maybe that let's go down to a seven yeah we'll equip this put a seven on there and maybe they won't be such monsters Well, there's another one, but maybe he'll be a little smaller. You can only hope. I don't know. He may be a little smaller. We'll see here. We've turned him around. This guy is smaller. Oh boy. I tell you, that was not easy to accomplish. Some big fish out here. Now we got him. Jack. It's a new record for me. 39.04 pounds. Not a no small fish, nothing to sneeze at, but apparently that's not as big as they can come, so. Hmm. Alright, we'll sell him. Maybe we'll try one more time here. Maybe make ourselves feel a little better. Throw it right in this group here. Looks like there's a bunch of different species in here, so. Yeah, the hook size is all important. You can definitely get the marlin, but they are just too strong unless you have level 20 or better gear. And some of the emmerjacks are the same way. Oh, there's a mahi-mahi. Well, we got him. He might be a little bigger than what we've caught in the past. Yeah, I think he might. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's bigger. He's not turning around yet. Yeah, 
he's starting to weaken. I can see it. Yeah, he's weakening. He's weakening. Based on what he was pulling on, I am certain he's a good sized one. Whoa, you gotta watch that. They do that crap. They'll make one last run at it and fool you. We got him. Not bad. No, he's not a record, but he's not bad. All right, guys. Well, we had a few failures, but we did have some successes, and we learned a few things. Definitely learned that you have to be at a certain level to do certain species. And level 14 is not it. <laughs> okay. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next episode. So until then, I'll see you later. Bye-bye. <laughs>